Hi besties, welcome back to the channel. My name is Michaela Amari. If you have never seen my face before, but if you have, hey cousin, welcome back. <laughs> Currently it is a Wednesday and it is 10.32 a.m. Your girl is up, she's ready, she's out the house, and she's about to go run a couple errands because today is all about productivity. I move in T minus like four days three days at this point and nothing is packed everything just looks normal in my room as if we're not about to move so i have a whole to-do list of things that i need to do but we'll get into the whole to-do list later basically today i'm just being super productive i'm getting things done and out the way basically to prepare to move which is really just tackling my room and my closet and also my bathroom like i said i wrote down a whole to-do list of the things that i need to get done today so i'm gonna go ahead and read you off my to-do list that way y'all can kind of know the stuff that we're getting into today first i decided to leave the house to go room decor shopping i placed the whole like 300 amazon order and all of that stuff comes in today but i'm not going to show y'all that until my next video that's when i'll be actually in the house unpacking everything so y'all will get a haul of that but i do need to go get a new comforter and a new bathroom set those are the two things that i didn't want to order off amazon because i want to go look at the options so i think i want to hit up ross my sister always helps me out with coda like taking him outside and stuff when i'm either not at home or i just don't feel like taking him outside she'll go and help me with that i also wanted to go to alta and get something for her she really likes bumble skincare and i seen a pack like a whole bumble skincare pack in there the last time i went and i was going to get it for her but i just never got it and then a couple days ago we were in walmart with my mom and she seen bubble skincare and she really wanted it she threw a whole fit and like the products in there were like $15 for just one but at Ulta you can get like a whole set for $34 so I think I'm gonna just go ahead and go get that for her you know like just take it off my mom's plate and I'm just gonna get it for her especially because she always helps me and she doesn't complain about it ever so best big sister award goes to me I need to deep clean my closet including my drawers inside of my closet I want to do like a huge closet clean out and just start fresh um, because there's so many pieces in my closet that I just don't wear and it takes up a lot of space now in my new house there will be a lot more closet space for me but still i just don't want to take anything that i haven't looked at and in my brain i'm thinking if i have not wore this in 2024 it's going away because obviously i'm never going to wear it <laughs> speaking of clothes and closet i also need to put away my clean laundry i need to tidy my room and just organize it my room isn't dirty but there's places that i can organize like my perfumes and like all my hair care under my bathroom sink my vanity and my little dresser and then lastly i just need to clean my bathroom but somewhere while i'm out i need to go ahead and get gas because i only have 91 miles y'all i always need gas but we're gonna get it handled today so that is my whole to-do list i'm going to be being very productive today i'm just praying that i can get everything done and out the way that way the next few days i could just focus on editing until it actually is time to move and we move on the first i have this fair life core power high protein milkshake i tried the vanilla one yesterday and it was pretty good like it didn't taste like much to me it just tasted like two percent milk so today i'm going to try the chocolate it did low-key make my stomach hurt which i don't know if protein is supposed to make your stomach hurt but i this actually filled me up and i love that for me because a lot of the times i'm not really hungry for food but if i have like a protein shake i'll get the same effect as being full basically i just want to taste this on cam with y'all this is the chocolate flavor tastes like chocolate milk these are pretty good one of my mutuals on instagram actually told me to try like the strawberry banana flavor or something like that i've seen a whole bunch of flavors at food line i want to try those eventually but this is really good if you're not a protein shake type of girl like me i 90 percent of protein shakes that i've tried i just do not like because they either taste really chalky and like you can tell it's a protein shake but these are the best ones that i've tried and i'm honestly going to stick to these because they just taste like milk I can get into this i'm about to go ahead and head to ross because that's my first stop i want to go ahead and get all my errands out the way such as getting gas and like going to stores and stuff yeah we're about to go ahead and make our way to ross to find a comforter because i think i can find a good one in there and then i'm gonna also look at their bathroom decor and if i can't find anything in there i might try walmart and i might try target my ross normally has such good stuff so i feel like i could find everything in there but i would still have to go to walmart to find like little bathroom carpets and stuff like that i really don't know girl i really don't know let's go ahead and head to ross 
hey besties so before we get any further into the vlog i did want to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by ally grace hair and they sent me over a 13 by 4 invisible lace wig and when i tell y'all ally grace is my favorite hair company to work with i have got so many compliments on how my hair looks like it's coming straight from the scalp i literally love this company and they will never do you wrong First of all, the hair is all human hair. It's so soft. And the thing about straight wigs, y'all know that they shed a lot. But when you shop with Ellie Grace hair, I'm telling y'all, you'll have no problems. This hair is so pretty, and I definitely will be reinstalling it because with Ellie Grace hair, you can get so many wears out of your wig before you even think about having to buy a new one. So thank you, Ellie Grace, for sponsoring this video. Make sure y'all check the description box down below for all the coupon codes and more details on this hair. And just Ellie greats itself thank you so much and let's get back into the hair vlog get for her i try to find the lemmy gummies in here but i can never find them they're always sold out i want to try them so bad but they're just never in here so i'm just about to get this and check out i might look around but those gummies are literally always sold out i see the good molecules right here but i just never know what to try they got a whole kit for 24 dollars but I don't know because my skincare is real good and I don't want to fuck it up. I just don't. Alright y'all, so I made it out of Ross and it is now raining. I literally beat the rain. As soon as I got in the car, it started raining so hard. But I was in there for a while because I was trying to decide if I wanted to just go to Walmart and find a shower curtain and rugs and everything like that or just buy it in a set but i wanted to do like a neutral theme for my room and my bathroom just keep it very neutral and it have like green plants with accents of gold i already knew i wasn't going to find anything like that in walmart so i just went ahead and got the shower curtain i got some rugs and i went ahead and got the comforter that's all back there i was struggling carrying all that stuff out the door because with ross you're not allowed to take their carts outside i guess because we would be stealing them i beat the rain by the grace of god so that's good i do have 82 miles now but honestly honestly i could get by on that 
for like another week and I'm not playing because for the next couple days I'm not gonna be leaving the house at all until we move so I know that I don't really really need gas but I'll probably get gas one of those other days because when it's raining I just don't feel like doing anything and even though today is a productive day we are still gonna be productive but I definitely just don't feel like getting out the car plus I'm worn out from carrying all that stuff back to the car by myself but you got to do what you got to do yeah it is 11 48 now I'm about to go ahead and head back home and then I'm gonna give y'all a haul so I'll see y'all when I get back home okay y'all so I just made it back home and I wanted to just show y'all a quick little haul I think I'm gonna go ahead and put this stuff in my trunk that way it's just not in my room laying around so I'm gonna just put it back in my car that way I don't know like I'll probably take most of my like clothes and my decor stuff in my car as much as I can fit because I feel like that just makes the most sense just throwing it in there that way it's not in the way first thing I got was this comforter set so this is what it looks like the lighting is kind of making it look cream but it is a neutral color i got this in a queen because my new mattress is very thick full size fitting sheets like slide up on the bed now that i think about it the queen sizes actually don't fit so i may have to just opt for a king like get one from walmart or something like that in the same color but i got this because it's literally so soft it comes with a little pillow Two pillowcases, the comforter, a fitted sheet, a flat sheet, and then two regular white pillowcases as well. This was $49.99, so I just went ahead and picked this up. Like I said, I'm doing my room and my bathroom like very neutral colors because I feel like I wanted to give grown women. Now that I think about it, I might also get new curtains. The ones I have would definitely match the vibe but i might get white ones i didn't want to buy any wall decor just yet i'll do that in my next video because i want to get in my room and actually see how i'm gonna lay out everything to know what i want to put on what wall if that makes sense just in case i don't like something or don't need something because i also do have lots of other room decor stashed away in my closet from all the other million times that i have redone my room so yeah i got this it's super cute super soft then i went ahead and got my bathroom decor i already ordered like some wall decor on amazon to put above my toilet which i think is the only thing we're going to have on the wall i did get this pack of two bathroom rugs the way that they had it when we went to go view the house they didn't have like three different rugs like i have in my bathroom because it's shaped differently so i just got this one that's like a pack of two y'all can barely see but it's just like a cream color and then for these two rugs it was only $13.99 i had to change the lighting because i feel like when i'm in front of my vanity everything is just like white and washed out but i did get this shower set which is just a shower curtain and then the little hooks like y'all can barely even see the real color of this maybe if i back up it's like a cream with white flowers on it so i feel like this would be cute and then i just got a shower liner this was only 4.99 and then the shower curtain and the hooks was only 9.99 so i spent a total of like 84 dollars that was pretty cheap to get everything that i really needed because i really just wanted to get the rugs shower curtain and comforter out the way so yeah um now i'm about to get into cleaning i don't know what exactly i'm gonna do first maybe go through my closet i need to get some trash bags I'm gonna actually put some stuff in my car like this stuff. I'm gonna bag up all my shoes that I know I'm not gonna wear. I'm gonna put that in my car just to have stuff out of the way. So yeah, I don't know what we're gonna be doing next, but I'll see y'all when we're doing it. Okay y'all, so I got some trash bags and we finna get to work. I'm gonna start with this little thing first because I have been meaning to clean this out or I don't know how long there's just junk just so much junk i'm gonna go ahead and go through all of these really quickly and just throw the stuff away that i just legit do not need like i'm trying to have a whole fresh start every drawer is full with junk i think this is the only clean and organized drawer that i have so i'm gonna skip this one because actually no i'm gonna still go through everything and just look and see what i do need what i don't need and then i'm gonna just reorganize it i have a trash bag for all of the trash and we're just gonna start let's go ahead and clean this out i'm low-key scared that like a rat will literally pop out of here because i haven't looked in these drawers and i don't know how long girl ah, i found my diploma All 
All right, you guys, so I'm now back in the car because your girl is hungry. My stomach is touching my back. It's time for lunch. It's time for lunch. It is 1.45 p.m., and I want to take a break and go get lunch. And y'all know what I'm craving? Do y'all know what I'm craving? Chipotle! Like, I don't know why Chipotle always be thinking about me. I wonder what Chipotle and them is doing right now because it just seems like I'm always on their mind. They always want me to come there and get some food. So I'm like, you know what? Since Chipotle been thinking about me lately, I'm going to feed into the craving. So I'm going to go get me some Chipotle for lunch. I'm going to bring it back home though because I want to watch Grey's Anatomy take a little break while I'm eating. I went through my little dresser thing. I have a whole bag of trash. So now everything is like in a nice place. When I move, I'll find like somewhere that it's supposed to be. Like I need to find a place for everything. Um, Just organize it really. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that little dresser when I move, if I'm gonna put it in my room or like put it in my closet. I don't know exactly what I'm gonna do with it, but I'll figure it out because I need to also, <sighs> I don't know. I got so much other shit to go through. Layla and her best friend Diane had came over and just chatted with me for a little bit while I was doing that. But then they was like, they about to go eat. So I'm like, dang, I'm hungry too. I haven't ate all day. So we finna go get some Chipotle. Yeah, that just sounds so good right now. I think I want a burrito. The last time I had Chipotle, I had a burrito too. So that's what it's giving. Like it's giving, go to Chipotle, get you a burrito. And I'm gonna go to the good Chipotle this time. We have two Chipotles in our city. One that's closer to me and one that's a little bit farther away. And the one that's farther away is like way better. They always have vinaigrette and it just be bust every single time. So that's what I'm about to go do. Let's go. Maybe we could do carpool karaoke while we drive because why not? I love a good carpool karaoke moment. From sitting on the ground going through those drawers, my back is aching. So I just made it home I got my Chipotle and I changed into some comfortable pants So I'm gonna show y'all my Chipotle order. I can't eat Chipotle without the vinaigrette So I got two. I normally just get one but I was being greedy So I got two then I got a side of queso I really only get a side of queso if I get a burrito because I feel like when I can just pour the queso on top It just makes it better. So I just got a little side of queso because them big sides of queso I don't need all that. I don't, I won't even use all the queso in that little container. I got a fork, some napkins. I got hella napkins. I always get hella napkins from Chipotle. I just restocked my car because I needed some more. And then the star of the show, I got a burrito, but I always get it in a bowl because it has a lot of fallout. I need something to catch it. So I get a bowl and then also if you really big, if you're back real big, all the fallout basically turns into a bowl so you can eat it but i usually don't <laughs> my back isn't that big in my burrito i get white or brown rice it just depends on the day and how i'm feeling today i got white rice pinto beans chicken corn sour cream and cheese and then i'll get queso in it sometimes or i'll just get a side but i just got a side today and they felt like working like he asked me if he gave me enough queso enough chicken i was like yeah like they normally don't ask me stuff like that they'll just not give a fuck for real that's my little chipotle order i'm about to grub right now though i'm about to turn on Grey's anatomy actually on the tv so yeah i'm about to eat right quick it is 2 38 i'll probably take like a little hour break so i'll be back to y'all around like 3 30 or something like that girl i don't know okay y'all so it is now 402 i watched like two episodes of Grey's anatomy i just finished one i was about to press play on another one because it was just getting so good but no we're going to tackle this closet so i'm gonna just show y'all everything that i got going on so i have shoes I have this little bin right here that holds all my undergarments, shorts, and t-shirts. And then also the bottom one holds all of my leggings. And then these are like my purses, my robe towels that like just belong to me. I obviously have all of my clothes. They're color coordinated. Up here I have shoe boxes. On this side I have like jeans, sweatpants, other type of pants. So I'm just going to go through all of this. I'm going to set all the clothes that I don't want aside, which I did a closet clean out not too long ago. So I don't think there would be that much stuff. But like I said, if I hadn't worn it, it's just, 
it has to go. This is the trash bag that I got from cleaning out my dresser. One bag I'm gonna use to put all of my shoes in, the ones that I'm not gonna wear in the next couple days. And then I'm gonna use this bag right here for all the clothes that I'm gonna give away. I never throw my clothes in the trash unless they're like ripped or have a stain on them. Either my little sister will take them and then if she doesn't, they just get donated to like a Salvation Army or something for the people who are less fortunate because you can always donate things instead of just throwing them away, so. Let's get started. I think I'm gonna go ahead and start with the shoes first. I'm gonna just show y'all how many pairs of shoes I have. I gotta use my flash because the lighting is so bad in here, but I have like slippers, Yeezys, Air Forces, Converse, hella pairs of Crocs, bubble slides, Ugg slippers, I have heels. All the shoes up there are just gonna stay up there in the boxes because they're just easier to transport that way. But these right here, I just don't have the boxes for. So like I said, everything that I'm not gonna be wearing is just gonna go in a plastic bag. And I know I won't need more than like two pairs of shoes. I've been wearing these shoes that I got for my birthday like every single day. So I'm gonna keep those out, probably a pair of slippers and then a pair of Crocs. And that's all. I got all of my shoes in bags. It actually took two whole trash bags to fill up the shoes. And then I put all my shoe boxes down at the bottom. Now I'm just about to go ahead and go through all of my clothes. I don't think there will be that many pieces in here. I feel like whenever I do closet cleanouts this time of the year, I always like throw away all my summer clothes. And then in the summer, I throw away all my fall clothes. So I'm trying to keep in mind that summer is coming up for the summer clothes that I haven't worn, if that makes sense. Out of all of my tops and stuff like that, it was only a couple pieces, but I'm gonna continue going. Oh, I do not feel like doing this. I'm gonna go through my pants and stuff as well. Don't want these. I know I'm keeping all of my jeans. I have two pairs of brand new jeans that I bought recently. And I don't really like them and I know I'm never going to wear them. So I'm actually just going to give those away. I got them from Aeropostale probably like a couple months ago. This dress was supposed to be my birthday dress. It's literally so cute. I'm not giving it away. It's just not on a hanger. So I need to put it on a hanger. Okay, boom. So everything is now went through besides those little drawers down there. So I'm just about to go through those really quickly. I'm pretty sure it won't be that much stuff. But I'm going to update y'all when I'm done. <laughs> So I took a little break. It's like a little bit past five o'clock now. Your girl is tired, but I still have more things to do. I want to go through this little organizer right here. I have some perfumes and body care, hair products, and then all this stuff down there, I don't even touch. So I feel like I should just go ahead and go through all of that. And then I also have perfumes up here that I'm gonna go through my collection because some of them I don't even really use. So I'm gonna just give them away. And then I also have under my bathroom sink, which really isn't a mess. Like those are all my girl products. I have cleaning supplies. And then this right here is just like all self care stuff. I honestly have no idea like what the fuck is back there. A lot of the stuff has been back there since I moved into this house. And like, I just put the shit back there. Yeah, I'm just about to go ahead and go through all of this stuff because this is the last thing that I have to do. And then at six o'clock, I have a video uploading. It's my birthday vlog. It turned out super cute and I can't wait for y'all to see it. It is 520. So hopefully I can get this done in like 20 minutes tops and just be done with it because I feel like I've been doing the most. I also put up my laundry as y'all saw. So all of my laundry, my closet and stuff is good. My shoes and stuff is packed up, but in the next video that y'all watch is when I'm going to actually be like packing stuff for real, for real. I think I'm going to pack like everything on the night of the 31st. That way on the 1st, when we wake up, get the U-Haul and everything, I can just hurry up and have everything situated and ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and clean the bathroom as well, which I forgot that I needed to do, but I'm going to go ahead and like wipe down all the surfaces. Actually, I'm not. There's no point in me doing that because the day that we move, we might I might as well clean as I'm going, like to make make sure everything is clean. So I'm actually not gonna wipe this stuff down. We're just gonna go through all this stuff. I'm gonna just start throwing shit away because honestly, with the stuff that's in here, if it's not like perfumes, if I'm not using it, I feel like it's just a little bit too much to give away. Like it's personal hygiene shit. So 
yeah, I got my trash bag, so let's get cleaning. Okay, y'all, so I just finished cleaning out my bathroom. Not really to my best ability, but like I organized the stuff, but most of it is already fairly organized. So I just threw away the stuff that I know I'm not using, like all of my old hairbrushes and like nasty edge combs and nasty products. I'll just get new products if I ever do need them, but a lot of that stuff I wasn't even touching anymore. So I just went ahead and threw it away. I'm out of breath because I just came back from taking Koda on a little walk, so whew. My mirror was at my front door that I ordered. This one is a lot bigger than the one that I have over there. So I'm super excited, it's a super cute and it's like a gold mirror, like it has gold accents. So the white one is gonna be going to like my mom or somebody, whoever needs a mirror. This one is so big and so cute. It's literally taller than me. So I'm happy to have a bigger mirror. That was one thing that I just, it was a non-negotiable. I want a bigger mirror because my other one is just so small. It's cutesy though, but I actually might keep that one too. Yeah, that's literally all the cleaning that I'm gonna do. I literally feel so out of breath. I feel so tired, but um, if I don't do anything else, I might as well just go ahead and end the video off here so that I don't forget. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give the video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell so that you never miss the time that I upload because my next video is going to be a whole entire moving vlog and it's going to be so fun. I want y'all to tune in so make sure you subscribe and turn on your post notifications so that you don't miss it. All of my social medias are linked down below in the description box because that's where I'm at when I'm not on here. I love y'all so much and I'll see y'all very soon with a brand new video.